Okay, today we're demonstrating how the BMT combo operates. It's short for boat, motor, trailer combination. Allows you to have all on one package. First we unload the boat. Obviously ensure all your straps, obviously your poles are in. We then lower the boat to the ground. It's all done by remote control. Assist the boat over to its upright position. Remove your ropes. Quick disconnect stainless fittings. As you get them out of the way, in turn move your boat out of the way. These little fellas aren't too heavy. And in turn retrieve the ropes back onto the drums. Ready for fitment to our frame, which or our rack assembly, which allows us to get all that gear on top there off. Obviously no lifting. Raise your rope back up. You then lower the framework back onto its position and lock it. Also, under all your latches that's holding your frame locked down in position. There are four of those, two either side. And place your, uh, your slide legs, fold them over onto the rack assembly, or I should say the framework, utilizing these uh, quick install pins, self-locking. Place them in the locked down position. and your front one. You then install the ropes. Very important. <laughs> because these ropes must be taut when you raise the frame back up. If not, this framework, including the motor and everything on it, wants to end up on the ground pretty quick. Take the load of the frame. You now raise your frame back up in the air to unload the... Where do you unload both your motor, trailer, fuel tank? Basically self-aligning its own rub pads, drop it down onto the ground. It's at a good working height to remove both your motor, trailer, fuel tank. Obviously, if you just wish to um, take your motor off, remove your, uh, you move your wheel assemblies. This is a mangrove jack trailer. Uh, you know, pretty much most trailers of this design so if you wish to leave your trailer on there or I should say in collapse form it's fairly easy got access to your motor and fuel tank I recommend a 15 horsepower um, mainly purely for the weight considerations but effectively with that that set up there you're looking around around about 80 to 100 kilos Okay, as you can see, this is just another product, part of the uh, Golf Flander Extreme uh, program. You uh, obviously, if you don't wish to have this unit and you want the rooftop tent, then it's just a simple process of installing it. Um, they're both pretty much interchangeable. Uh, the, the area there on, on, on top of the, the uh, frame assembly uh, has the capacity to take uh, obviously one unit at a time. So you can, you know, you can obviously have your tent, if you don't wish to have your tent, you put this arrangement up there um, and it's all fairly, 
fairly quick fit. All aluminium, lightweight as possible and uh, sturdy construction.